My name's Art Beam and I've been attending Royal Redeemer for somewhere between 20 and 25 years. The St. Herman's experience came out of a men's group that I had been participating in where we, we would do six to eight week studies and lots of good fellowship and conversation that eventually wound around to the point of, you know what, we come in and sit in this room and talk about Bible studies and helping others and loving others and spreading God's word. And we sit in this little room. And so why don't we reach out and try and do something different? At about the same time, I had a friend who was engaged and involved with St. Herman's uh, and had some conversations with him. He connected me with St. Herman's and it turns out that they were looking for people, groups of people that were willing to come in and prepare hot breakfast for the transitional uh, men that live at St. Herman's as well as the homeless population in the area. I said, this is God talking to me and everything coming together at the right time. And so for about the next five years, this, my men, the men's group that I'm a part of uh, served breakfast at St. Herman's once a month on a Friday morning. Uh, so it, it was one of, our, one of our men's group meetings every four weeks was serving at St. Herman's. And it was, it was the same experience as the mission trip in Haiti. We would grumble and groan about having to get up at five in the morning and meet in the Royal Redeemer parking lot and why did I sign up to do this? And two hours later we would leave St. Herman's alive and thankful and blessed and, and happy with what we've been able to do.